So this is my personal experience. Um, I think it'll apply to a lot of people, but like when I was dealing with depression, it was at the same time in college, about that same like sophomore year of college. Um, I was dealing with depression and fear, uh, night terrors and stuff like that. Um, before I went to college, my dad gave me a scripture. He wrote it on a piece of paper and printed it out. And it was Proverbs 3, 5. It says, trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your understandings. And that was a really important verse for me to have. It was what has become my life verse. Um, to trust in the Lord. You know, I think when we don't trust that we get into a fearful place. And even my name, Joshua, my mom named me that because of Joshua 1, 9. I had a lot of complications at birth. And the nurse told her to be strong and very courageous. And when you read Joshua, he says it to him so many times. Be strong and very courageous. You know, that's the opposite of fearful, is courageous. And it's like, I feel like God knew some of the things that I would struggle with in my lifetime. And um, having that key to being courageous, to trusting in Him. You know, when we don't trust someone, it's because we're afraid of something. We're afraid of the outcome. We're afraid of whatever it might be. And so trusting is a big one. And so coming on the other side of that, I can see clearly the things in my life that were causing fear, that were causing depression. Um, a lot of them were just attacks of the enemy, but a lot of them were things that I invited, you know. And so once I started to shut the doors in those areas and they were not invited anymore, they stopped. One of the things about that verse that's so powerful is, um, he says, be strong and very courageous, um, for I am with you. <laughs> and I think that when, if we actually knew that God was with us, God of the universe that created everything and mm -hmm. created us. If we actually knew that and believed that, then what else, what couldn't we face? What fear is there left, you know? Yeah. God is love, love drives out fear. We could go with joy into anything and know that he's with us, but sometimes we have to choose to remember that and believe it and fight for that. Somebody could literally die for us and we still wouldn't believe it. Yeah. We wouldn't be able to receive that love. They could give us everything. They could give us the moon, the stars, and they could literally die for us. But if we don't believe that they love us, then we won't receive any of the good things that they, they intended for us to have. That's literally how it is with God. <laughs> He's with us and we have to choose to believe that He loves us. And when you start that choice and you start to believe and just even with your mouth saying truth, um, it puts something in your heart that helps you mm -hmm. to kindle that faith and overcome, right? Yeah. I'm Lacey Sturm. And I'm Josh Sturm. And fear is a liar.